Hey there everyone, I've got a dinosaur tutorial to share with you today. I'm Lily Santoy, you can follow me on Instagram if you like. Alright, let's get started. I have Fusion Lime Green, and I actually have a Paint Pal uh, wash brush. We're going to go ahead and start out creating the dino head shape. So we want to remember that he's got a snout, and then we want to create this bone structure here. Alright, we're going to go ahead and paint this area. And this is going to be the base for our Dino Bite design. This design is really, really popular um, at birthday parties and at festivals as well. So, and you know, once you do it, um, you know, 10, 20 times, it gets much faster. Each step, you know, it just gets so much faster and you could just pull it off really quickly and it always gets a wow uh, from parents and friends. All right, so next up, we've got our uh, little Cornell round number three brush. I loaded it with, this is actually Party Explosion White, which I really like, and uh, we're creating the teeth here. Now at the bottom, of course, you want to do the same thing. You're just creating small teardrops and cascading up to the end. I messed up a little bit, so you do the drag and drop technique, and you still have your teeth. All right, next up is with the remaining paint that I have left on my brush, I'm gonna just create the sketch lines here. This is gonna be the, the jaw and the eye. So I just wanna make sure I know where I'm gonna be placing those. So again, with my same round number three brush, I create the jaw, the bottom jaw here. And then of course we're gonna fill in this line right here. This is that stretchy part of the lizard or dinosaur. Um, you know, when they open their mouth like a snake too, they have this like stretchy gum line part. So up here we're gonna create the eye. We're gonna go ahead and outline the bone structure of the dinosaur. Make sure that you make the bottom jaw like very square. See there? the bottom and then come back up and that creates like that um, you know dinosaurs reptiles it really shows that skeletal structure all right we're just gonna go down at an angle come straight down you know you don't want to do curved you want to go straight down then create this nostril here We're gonna create stripes here. I really like the stripes. It looks more like a raptor, which kids really seem to like lately. We're gonna also create this angry eye. And we're actually gonna fill in the whole area here with black. Now this is just gonna be the base of his eye. I'm gonna go ahead and create some dots. You're welcome to use any kind of reptile stencil that you like. I just like being really fast on the job, so I just, I'm, I'm happy with these dots. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and correct his jaw a little bit. And with the remaining paint the, on my brush, it's kind of dry, so we're just gonna create those um, sketchy lines just to make it look more aged. All right, now we've got, uh, this is Party Explosion Yellow, actually. I'm gonna go ahead and just put a dot right in the center of that black uh, area of his eye. I wiped off my brush onto a rag, and I'm using the dry brush technique again just to give it a few highlights here. I really prefer using color for highlights instead of white. I feel like white stands out a little too much. So here I'm gonna load my brush with Super Sur Suri or Fab Watermelon Works. And we're just gonna do the drag and drop technique to create these, um, like he's eaten something, so he's kinda got a bloody mess. All right, and with what the paint that's left on my brush, we'll go ahead and color in this um, stretchy area and around his eye as well. I really love the effect that this gives. 
gives it a little bit more depth. All right, and that pretty much completes our design. I appreciate you guys so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe. That way we can create more content for you. This is my on-the-job Dino Bite. Hope you guys loved it.